thank you for the leadership that each one of you are showing uh, in your states. Uh, we, uh, yesterday, the president took specific action with regard to California, uh, Washington State, uh, and New York. Uh, we'll talk about that uh, in a bit. Uh, but I know in speaking with so many of you myself and the regular contacts that we have had with you, uh, the extraordinary uh, leadership that's being demonstrated uh, by our governors uh, all across uh, uh, the states and territories of this nation. And so first and foremost, just allow me to say thank you, uh, not just on behalf of the president uh, and our team, but uh, what I know uh, is on behalf uh, of the American people. Um, uh, we're going to speak today uh, about issues that, uh, that you all continue to focus on and continue to be the focus of the White House Coronavirus Task Force. We'll be meeting uh, later this afternoon, but as you can see, we are here at FEMA. Uh, it was now a, a little bit more than 10 days ago that the president signed the emergency declaration. Uh, and it goes without saying that, uh, that FEMA is now the hub of all of our efforts. Pete Gaynor will share with you a bit about uh, how we have operationalized the president's vision uh, for uh, a response to the threat of the coronavirus threat that is uh, locally executed, state-managed, and federally supported. Uh, it is FEMA's mission. It's what uh, every governor on this uh, call knows they're good at. No one better in the world. Uh, and, uh, and Pete, I want to thank you. 20,000 strong, the team here at FEMA, stepping up, stepping into the gap, fully integrating HHS, uh, and working with the White House Coronavirus Task Force and all these governors. You're doing a phenomenal job. Uh, I hope that yesterday's action where the president uh, uh, signed major disaster declarations, initiated Title 32 uh, authority for three states to stand up your National Guard with full federal support, the deployment of field hospitals in those states, and the deployment of, uh, of PPE on an ongoing basis uh, gives each of you confidence uh, that, uh, that uh, uh, we're going to do whatever it takes. Uh, to make sure that our states uh, and your courageous uh, local health uh, officials have the support that you need to meet this moment. Dr. Deborah Burks will talk about some progress that we are making on data, understanding uh, what, uh, uh, what the circumstances in the ground are, better focusing our resources at the point of the need, and also some very important breakthroughs on uh, ventilators and how we're going to partner with you to expand the capacity of ventilators going forward. Uh, but before I dismiss the media, again, let me just say thank you to all the governors. Um, I mean, this, uh, it really is what makes America different, uh, that, uh, uh, that we have uh, 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 50 CEOs of states uh, and several territories who are with us here today. You are leading the efforts in your states. Uh, the federal government uh, is coming along behind you, supporting you, resourcing you with expertise personnel, uh, and it is a real partnership um, that is precisely, it precisely how the American people expect us to work. And uh, I just left the president a few minutes ago. He was on the phone with a governor uh, when I was leaving the Oval Office. And um, I just hope all of you know that while we will continue to use these large forums, not only to share information, but we'll have an ongoing conversation about what you're dealing with at the local level. But I hope you all know that... Um, uh, should any need arise, uh, contacting your regional administrator uh, for FEMA, letting them know what your specific needs are. Uh, but uh, I hope it goes without saying, I'm a phone call away to any governor uh, on this call. Uh, and uh, as you go through the ordinary processes, uh, you should not hesitate to reach me. And I think you also know the president. Uh, the president uh, values the relationship and the leadership represented by everyone here. So with that, uh, we'll have the media step out. We'll brief them uh, afterwards. Thank you all very much. Uh, and uh, uh, we'll, uh, we'll do a, a quick download here for a few minutes, but then we, we want to hear from you about questions that, uh, and issues that might be arising in your individual jurisdictions. Thank you all.